In this tutorial, we will discuss how to find Net Library eBooks, how to access those Net Library eBooks from off campus, how to print out from those Net Library eBooks, and how to cite a Net Library eBook as a source in your Works Cited page. The first thing you'll want to do is go to the library's homepage. The library's homepage is at the bottom of the Lambeth University website. The word library is in white letters in the center of the page. You click on the link that says library and it takes you to the library's homepage. Once you're at the library's homepage, you will find that the link to the Net Library eBooks is on the left side of the page under Library Databases. So I'm going to click on the link that says Net Library eBooks. Once you click on that link, if you are on campus, you will go directly to the search page, just like this. However, if you are off campus, you will need to have created a username and password in order to allow you to access Lambeth University's eLibrary content. So I'm going to click on this Create Free Account link up in the right corner, and you will go to a page where you can enter a username and password. And this is whatever you would like for it to be. Just go ahead and create one. And it has a security question down there to ask you and just make sure that you uh, remember the answer to your security question. Okay, I'm going back to the search page here and I'm going to search for something. I'm interested in Russia and the geography of Russia. So I'm going to type in Russia and type in geography. And what this will do, it will search through the content of all the Net Library eBooks to which Lambeth subscribes and give us some results. Click search. Okay, you have the title of the book here, you have an image of the cover of the book, and you have a description of the book. As you can see, our search terms are all highlighted in yellow. I'm going to look at one here. I'm going to click on the cover and it's going to open the book up and show me the content inside the book. Okay, As it loads you will notice that on the left side of the page there where the cursor is, there's a, a link that says contents. This tab shows you the table of contents for the book. You can click on any link and go directly to that chapter or that part of the book. There's also another tab which is search, which means you can search for keywords within the book. There's also another tab which is e-content details. Under e-content details you will find information about how to cite the book. Here's the cover of the book and you can use the scroll bar to move up and down the page. Notice it's only showing you one page at a time and we're going to look here at the table of contents and I'm going to click on chapter 2 and I'm going to go directly to chapter 2. So over on the right side of the screen is the first page of chapter 2. Now you can adjust the size of these windows inside of the Net Library eBooks. Scroll down the page and you can see the words. Now it's important to remember here that you can only print one page at a time. There's also some controls that will let you move through the book. Notice I've clicked on Next. Next takes you to the next page in the book. As you can see, it's a map. So you could actually page through the book by using the Next button. You can also go to a specific page in the book by typing a page number into the box next to Page. type in page 200, click on go, and it will take you to page 200 in the book. Okay, let's look at the e-content details and the search function. Okay, search. Let's say that I search for the word wildlife. So it searches through the entire text of the book looking for the term wildlife. type in my search term 
click on search and I get some results and what you see here are the sentences in which the search term occurred and the search term is highlighted in yellow okay I'm gonna click on view this page and it's gonna take me directly to the page where the search term appears and the page is going to pop up in the right side of the window as you can see the images and everything that's in the book does appear so it is the full content of the book and it is presented as a PDF image you can print out so you use that button that says print current page and a box will open and you tell it that you want to open this search page so you click open and it's opening and it opens it up in Adobe Reader so make sure that you have Adobe Reader installed on your computer and you use the print icon at the top of the Adobe Reader you don't want to use the print icon in the web browser because that will just print out a blank page so I click OK to print this page out and the page comes out at the printer Okay, I'm going to close this window down. I'm going to go back over to my navigation controls and I'm going to click on eContent Details. And what you have here in eContent Details is the title of the book, okay, the author of the book, the publisher and the place of publication, and the year of publication. This is all important information that you will use to cite this in your lists of works cited. In just a minute I'm going to show you the link on the library's webpage that will give you examples of how to cite net library ebooks. As you can see that's the year. It's Texas A&M University Press 2003. So let's go back to the library's website okay, and go down under research guides and you'll see these are all guides that you can use to help you do research and cite sources. There's a link there for citing net library ebooks. So I'm going to click on that link and you'll go to a web page that will have examples for both APA style and MLA style. And this page will tell you what information you need to do your citations and give you examples of citations. Now within Net Library eBooks there's two types of sources. There's publicly accessible titles which means titles that are no longer copyrighted and then there are titles which still have a copyright. And there's different ways to cite those sources. As you can see there's, there's a, examples for copyrighted sources and examples for publicly accessible titles. So there you have it. A tutorial on how to find Net Library eBooks, how to navigate through the Net Library eBooks controls, how to log in to Net Library eBooks from off campus, and how to cite a Net Library eBook source once you find one that you can use.